Hey everyone, how you all doing? I'm Welt here, back with another video. And as you can see in front of you, this is the Hogwarts castle inside for Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. So I was thinking, you know, in the previous videos, I basically showed you that I released this new update for the Unworld Hub, which lets you edit your Harry Potter games. You can make new maps, you can explore the levels inside the game, you can also share your own custom creations and stuff, which is pretty cool. So you come here, you click this button, Launch Editor. If you don't already have the editor, it will download automatically, it will install, and it will launch. So just click this button, and you should get this editor started. So how to basically use the editor. When you open up, you'll have these four screens. Top view, front view, side view and the 3D view of your map. These are basically different views of the map. How do you open a map? Simple. You click open and you go to your Harry Potter folder. So mine is, I'll just show you mine is here. And you go to maps and we'll open just one map here just as an example today. We'll open Entry Hall Hub as an example. There we go. Now once you've got the map, how can you actually move around in this world? So in your top view, if you just hold the left mouse button and just move your mouse around, then you can go around across the map and stuff. To zoom out, how do you zoom out and zoom in? Press and hold both left and right mouse button and move the mouse backwards and forwards to zoom in or out. Same thing with the front view. Zoom in, zoom out, and the side view. Uh, the 3D view is slightly different, and I'll show you how that works. 3D view, how do you move forward in the 3D view? Well, you just hold the left mouse button, you go forward, you go backward, works like that. How do you look around? How do you rotate? So, holding the right mouse button this time, you go you know, rotate left, rotate right, rotate up, rotate down. Okay, so that's cool. How do you move up or down? To move up or down, you hold both mouse buttons. Move the mouse forward to go up. Move the mouse down to go down. And as you can see, that way we can easily explore these levels and we can see what all these cool things are. You got this little character here already, just a random ginger guy, portraits. These are all the different surfaces of these walls that you can put different textures on. So once you've got the controls out the way and how you can select stuff, how do we actually open like textures and how do we add stuff into the this world? So up across the top here you will see a bunch of tools for, for making a new world, opening, saving, etc. And I'll show you some of these, some of these we'll be using very often. So if you click this, this is a texture browser and what you can do is if you want to see how like different pictures and stuff you go to your Harry Potter 3 folder Harry Potter 2 folder I mean you go to your Harry Potter 2 folder open the textures folder and let's say we want to open this one HP2 Master, this has got a lot of textures here that the game uses so there we go we can see all these different textures, we've got arches, we've got banners ceiling textures, doors, you know, all, this cool, all these cool things. What else? What, what, what are the other important things in the game? So how do you actually add stuff to the game? Adding stuff, this involves something called actors. Everything in the game is an actor this golden chest which spews out basically collectible 
Bertie bought every flavoured beans. This light here, all these things, these are all called actors in the editor. How would you add these things? So let's say I want to add something onto this carpet. Click the actors menu. Let's go pawn. Player pawn. UW player pawn. And we've got Harry here. So let's add Harry. Right click. Add Harry here. And there we go. We've got our main hero character standing there in the middle of the map. So, press delete to get rid of him. And it's the same for every other actor in the world. So that's it guys, now you've got the basics down, how to set up the editor, open different maps, move around the world etc, add some stuff of your own. And in the next video what I'll be showing you is how we make our own brand new custom handmade levels. So thanks for watching guys, if you enjoyed the video, you know what to do, hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button and if you want to get more people involved in this. Now you might want to share your maps with other people as well, show other people what kind of cool stuff you made, how you made it. Uh, share this video with your friends so that everyone knows about more than Harry Potter. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video. Stay awesome.